When it comes to military innovations, few technologies have had the impact of Chobham armor. This advanced composite armor, originally developed in the United Kingdom, transformed the field of armored vehicle protection and became a critical component in the design of modern battle tanks. But what exactly is Chobham armor? And how did it come to revolutionize tank design? To understand its significance, we must delve into the history of tank development and the challenges that led to its creation. Welcome to the History of Simple Things, where we delve into the fascinating history behind the little things that shape our world. The origins of Chobham armor date back to the mid-20th century, a time when armored warfare was undergoing significant evolution. During World War II, tanks became a dominant force on the battlefield, but their vulnerabilities were quickly exploited. As anti-tank weapons became more sophisticated, traditional steel armor was no longer sufficient to protect crews from high-velocity rounds and shape-charge warheads. The latter posed a particularly significant challenge, as these warheads could focus explosive energy into a narrow jet capable of piercing even the thickest steel. By the post-war period, it was clear that a new approach to tank armor was needed, one that could offer superior protection without compromising mobility. The quest for improved tank armor led to experiments with various materials and designs. It was against this backdrop that the Chobham Common Facility in Surrey, England, emerged as a hub for armor research. The British Ministry of Defense established the Fighting Vehicle Research and Development Establishment at Chobham, where scientists began exploring composite materials for tank protection. The goal was to develop an armor system that could effectively counter the threats posed by shape charges and kinetic energy penetrators, while also being relatively lightweight and easy to manufacture. The breakthrough came in the 1960s with the development of a new type of composite armor. Chobham armor, as it would later be known, combined layers of ceramic tiles, metal backing, and synthetic materials, all arranged in a specific configuration to maximize their protective qualities. Ceramic tiles were particularly effective at disrupting shape-charged jets as they caused the jet to dissipate its energy upon impact. Meanwhile, the metal and synthetic layers absorbed the residual energy, further reducing the likelihood of penetration. This multi-layered approach represented a radical departure from traditional monolithic steel armor, offering a level of protection that was previously unattainable. One of the first tanks to benefit from Chobham armor was the British Challenger One, which entered service in the 1980s. The armor's performance during trials was nothing short of revolutionary, demonstrating its ability to withstand direct hits from modern anti-tank weapons. Its effectiveness was further proven in combat during the Gulf War in 1991, where Challenger 1 tanks equipped with Chobham armor showed remarkable survivability against Iraqi forces. The armor not only protected the crews, but also allowed the tanks to continue operating even after taking hits, showcasing the resilience that made Chobham armor a game-changer. The success of Chobham armor quickly drew the attention of other nations, leading to its incorporation into the designs of various tanks around the world. Notably, the American M1 Abrams tank adopted a derivative of Chobham armor, which was further refined and adapted to meet U.S. military requirements. The M1 Abrams, equipped with this advanced armor, became one of the most formidable tanks of its era, combining exceptional protection with cutting-edge firepower and mobility. Over time, variations of Chobham armor have also been integrated into other tanks, including the German Leopard 2 and the Japanese Type 90. Despite its widespread adoption, the exact composition of Chobham armor remains a closely guarded secret, reflecting its strategic importance. What is known, however, is that the principles behind its design have influenced the development of other protective technologies. The use of layered materials, including ceramics and composites, 
has become a standard approach in modern armor systems, extending beyond tanks to include armored personnel carriers, helicopters, and even naval vessels. This versatility underscores the far-reaching impact of Chobam armor on military engineering. One of the reasons for Chobham Armor's enduring relevance is its adaptability. Over the years, it has been continually upgraded to address new threats, such as tandem warheads and advanced kinetic energy penetrators. These advancements have ensured that tanks equipped with Chobham-derived armor remain viable on the modern battlefield, even as anti-tank weapons become increasingly sophisticated. Additionally, research into new materials and manufacturing techniques has further enhanced the performance of composite armors, building on the foundation laid by Chobham Armor. Beyond its technical achievements, Chobham Armor holds a symbolic significance as a testament to human ingenuity in the face of adversity. Its development exemplifies the collaborative efforts of scientists engineers, and military strategists, all working together to overcome a critical challenge. By rethinking the fundamental principles of armor design, they created a technology that not only saved lives, but also shaped the course of armored warfare. As we look to the future, the legacy of Chobam armor continues to influence the direction of military technology. Emerging trends such as active protection systems, which use sensors and interceptors to neutralize incoming threats, are being integrated with traditional armor to create even more advanced defensive capabilities. While these systems represent a new frontier in tank protection, they are built upon the same principles of innovation and adaptability that define the development of Chabam armor. The history of Chobham Armor is a story of transformation and resilience, from its origins in the research labs of Chobham Common to its battlefield successes in conflicts around the world, this revolutionary armor has redefined what is possible in tank protection. Its influence extends far beyond the tanks it was designed to protect, serving as a foundation for a wide range of military technologies. As armored warfare continues to evolve, Chobham Armor stands as a reminder of the power of innovation to change the course of history. Thank you for watching. If you have suggestions for our next video, feel free to share them in the comments below. We'll be sure to give you an acknowledgement for your contribution. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the history of simple things. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more stories woven through the smallest details.